brain. in Paris that was covered with vines lived 12 little girls in two straight lines. They left the house in two straight lines at half past nine. <laughs> the smallest one was Madeline. rain last night had left a flood, and Madeline's wagon stuck in mud. And soon she had to scream and shout. Oh, I cannot get my wagon out. Could somebody help me, please? Stop your mouth. Of course. I'm coming. Right away. You do it this way, Madeline. Uh, 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 uh. Sorry. No, no, look at me. No, this way. Good work, girls. You're a mess. <laughs> Let me try. Right all day. Look, this is how it is done. I can see you need my help. <laughs> If you do not like the way we are helping, tant pis. Too bad. Wait! Poor Madeline felt such frustration. No one had learned cooperation. Then Miss Clavel received a letter. Mm. That would make them all feel so much better. Jeune fille, little girls. We are coming, Miss Clavel. What is it, Miss Clavel? Lord Cuckoo Face has invited us to visit his perfume factory. His perfume factory? It is in the south, in Grasse. That is where the best perfume in the world is made. I cannot wait. Me neither. Miss Clavel? May we try the perfume? I think that we probably can, Lulu. A perfume factory? Why would anyone want to go there? Perhaps you should come with us, Pepito, and see. Oh, come on, Pepito. Come with us. Oh, please. It will be fun. All right, but please do not spray that smelly stuff on me. They took a train that soon would pass. The fields of flowers all round grass. It is so beautiful here, and it smells even better. And waiting for them at his place was their friend, Lord Cuckoo Face. Bienvenue! Welcome! I am so glad you could come to my perfume factory. <laughs> so are so we, are Lord Cuckoo Face. Come, I will show you around. He showed them vats. He showed them labels. He showed them perfume mixing tables. Ah. And the best perfume he could derive, the famous Cuckoo, number five. It is the finest perfume I have ever made, little girls. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's so good. Very 
first batch is going to Paris at three o'clock today. Now, who would like to try some? <laughs> well done, Lulu. Uh, voila. There it is. Mm. Oh, it is heaven. It is divine. P.U. You know, a perfume is made from many ingredients. Oils from the muskrat, the deer, and the whale. And from cedar wood, geranium leaves, roses, violets, and lavender. You mean there is a whale in cuckoo number five? Oh, I cannot say, Pepito. It is a secret. He showed them how it all was done, mixing aromas one by one. And who did this, do you suppose? A great artiste they called the Nose. Ahem. <clears throat> Bonjour. Bonjour, Monsieur Nose. The nose is a true artist. Really? He can tell by smell every one of these scents. Can you give us a demonstration? Ah, if I must. Allez-y. Go ahead. Qu'est-ce que c'est, Monsieur Nose? What is this? <laughs> uh, lavender. Violets. Oh. What about this? <laughs> Very dirty socks. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh. hmm. After the tour, Miss Clavel took them all outside to smell. Not the lovely little girls. Mm. Oui, Miss Clavel. Mm. But Pepito did not choose to sniff or even take a single whiff. <laughs> he found such flower sniffing boring and instead went off exploring. What is it, Pepito? Shh. Mira, look. Oh, poor little skunk. He must be allergic to the flowers. Madeline, Pepito, we are going to go back to the... <gasps> A skunk! C'est horrible! That is horrible! He is not well, Miss Clavel. Can we take him inside with us? Por favor! Oh, s'il vous plaît, Miss Clavel, please. Absolument pas. Absolutely not. A perfume factory is no place for a skunk. Now leave it here and come along. Oui, Miss Clavel. Goodbye, little skunk. <laughs> Miss Clavel now told her bunch the grown ups would go out to lunch. The girls could have some bread and brie, then tour more of the factory. Bon appetit, everyone! Enjoy your meal too, Miss Clavel! I cannot eat another bite. Oh, neither can I. Huh? What was that? Pepito. That? That was... me. I always sneeze when I am full. Huh? Huh? <whistles> the girls were shocked to see a skunk. But soon they realized they were sunk. <laughs> Unless they caught it on the double, they would be in heaps of trouble. Come, my friends. We must hurry. This way. Hello. 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 
They chased the skunk under the table. They chased it with a sticky label. This way. They chased it past a floating feather. Until they cornered it together. Come here, little skunk. We will not hurt you. Oh, no! It sprayed them all. No one felt well because of the offensive smell. That is the worst thing I've ever smelled in my entire life. What should we do? I know. Come here, little skunk. This will make him smell better. And we can put the perfume on ourselves. And so within three seconds flat, the little skunk went in the vat. Voila! There! It is much better! in an hour to take it to the bottling plant in Paris. If it does not get shipped, Lord Cuckoo Face will be ruined. What should we do? The children plotted and decided to overcome the dread and gloom. They'd mix a batch of new perfume. We must find a secret formula to cuckoo number five. D'accord, right. Perhaps it is in here. I am sure we can do this without a formula. Ooh, maybe these will drown out the skunk smell. Papito! Blossoms. Ow! Uh! Put the whole basket in. No, oh no! We must work together, or this will end up like my wagon. You are right, Madeline. So let us each take a different job. First of all, the nose will be able to tell the formula is wrong from far away. I will delay him. Très bien, good. And since I did not get sprayed, I still smell like cuckoo number five. So you can judge the new batch by comparing it to me. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. My nose is good. I can sniff and tell if what is in the vat is the same as what is on Lulu. I will put the scent in little bottles. And I will write everything down so we know exactly what we have done. Pepito? Um, and I will take the deer back to the woods. Obulo, to work. When you must get something done. Under toi, ooh la la. Here's a way that's always fun. Do the job together. If you have a mammoth task. Under toi, oh la la. How to do it, you might ask. Do the job together. Works as a crew. We know that we'll get through it. 
Though they worked hard, there was no telling how the new perfume was smelling. It is Doctor Two Three. We must work faster. Quickly, Nona. But before they dropped in one more rose. Who should come in? It was... <gasps> the nose! Something smells... off! Oh! You must not be exposed to something off, Monsieur Le Nose. Let us go outside. No! What are you hiding? Oh! Oh, I'm um, there. Why would they be hiding oh. anything? Oh. <laughs> Fresh ground pepper? Uh, 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 it may be ruined forever! <laughs> we only have ten minutes! Nothing had worked. No one knew why. Still, there was one thing left to try. Yose, my cedar tree! Hurry, Pepito! Keskiria, what is that? Coming towards them was a truck. It seemed that they were out of luck. Oh, no! <gasps> hmm. That is very, very close. Oh, no! Something smells fishy. <gasps> well, not fishy, uh, cedary with uh, rose and geraniums and just a hint of violet. Number five, you have changed the formula. What? Oh. <gasps> oh. Yeah, this is impossible. How? Oh, how could this have happened? <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> I have been. Trying to create that scent for 20 years. You have? And it is brilliant! <laughs> it is? Oh, thank goodness. I Much better than the original number five. That is wonderful. What happened? We dropped a skunk in it. A skunk? skunk? Yes, and several other things, too. <laughs> Here is the formula. But this is formidable! Fabulous! Huh? And so complicated! How did you do it? Teamwork! <laughs> they went back home and broke their bread we love our bread, we love our butter, but most of all, we love each other. And brushed their teeth and went to bed. Their fragrance reached the bedroom door. <sighs> and that's all there is. There isn't any more. If you believe you must be big 
know the clue be tough, then you should get to know me. I'll teach you other stuff. I'm 